Hello class, Mr. Linder here and welcome to the unit one uh, video. You'll notice that we're in modules again. First thing I want to show you is that once you have completed a module, you can go ahead and hide the contents of it. So since you are done with navigating your online education, you can simply click the arrow and that'll hide that uh, module. And then that brings us to unit one starts here. And this is your Welcome to Unit 1 video that you're currently watching. And then we have Introduction to Unit 1 under Week 1. So I'll go ahead and click on that. And the introduction just uh, tells you a little bit about what you're going to be doing for the next uh, four weeks of the semester. Uh, and it shows you the four modules that you'll be working on. So you're going to be working on Human Biology, Science and Society, uh, the chemistry of living things, structure and function of cells, uh, and then also from cells to organ systems. And what we'll be doing over the next four weeks uh, is basically learning about uh, the characteristics of life. Uh, we'll be looking at chemistry and the structure of atoms uh, and molecules and how uh, atoms bond together to form molecules, uh, the various biomolecules that make up the human body. When we get to chapter three, structure and function of cells, that's exactly what we'll be looking at, is how do cells function, uh, looking at the various organelles of cells uh, and the various uh, transport mechanisms across uh, the membrane of cells. We'll also be looking at how cells uh, can produce uh, ATP uh, from the uh, biomolecules that we consume. In chapter four, uh, we'll be looking at tissues, so how we organize cells together to form various tissues of the body. Uh, and then we'll also be looking at our first system uh, of the semester, which is the integumentary system. So when you're ready to start your first week, you'll just click next, and that'll take you to your first discussion. Uh, your first discussion is just simply introducing yourself to the class uh, and then also commenting on other uh, people's posts in the discussion. And so you'll have until Friday to complete uh, that discussion. Click Next and that'll take you to your links that you need to be successful uh, for Chapter 1. Uh, so you have your Chapter 1 lecture notes that you can print out and take notes on, or you can type them on your computer. You also have a PowerPoint presentation that you can reference as you're going through uh, the various videos and reading the textbook. Uh, you also have a link to your e-text that you purchased through Mastering. Uh, as you click next, you'll see your first uh, page and video to watch. It says to read pages two to four of your textbook and take notes uh, on your lecture notes uh, outline. Again, it has a link to your textbook again, uh, and then it has a video on themes of biology. As you click next throughout the module, it'll take you to various videos to watch, pages to read in your textbook, uh, getting you guys prepared uh, for uh, the concept review questions at the end of the chapter. So I want to show you back on the main modules page what that looks like uh, for the week. So here we have the discussion uh, that you took a look at. Here's your links to your lecture notes and PowerPoint. Uh, and then here's the various videos and the reading assignments as you fill in uh, your lecture notes. After you finish uh, all of those videos and you fill in your lecture notes, you have your concept review assignment. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And it just shows you uh, where your concept review can be found, page 19 of your textbook. And then it also tells you what questions you're going to be working on. So you'll be answering questions one, two, three, and four. Uh, you'll be writing those on a piece of paper, or you can type them on your laptop. Uh, and then you'll be uploading that document uh, either as a doc or docs uh, or a PDF file if you scan a handwritten one, uh, and you'll upload that assignment. If you click Next after that assignment, it'll bring us to your laboratory link. So each week you'll have a laboratory uh, assignment to do. Uh, the first one is on microscopy and the metric system and the scientific method. It's exercises one and two in your lab book. Uh, this is your laboratory link. So you'll want to open that up and take a look at uh, what activities you're doing in the exercises. 
And then if you click next, they'll take you to the videos that are going to help you uh, to perform your laboratory work from home. Uh, so we have parts of the microscope. Uh, we have how to use a microscope and focus a microscope. Uh, when you look at uh, threads under the microscope, how to uh, measure visual fields, uh, and then also how to prepare cheek cells. Uh, and it'll show you what they look like in drawings that you guys can do. So again, I'll take you back to the modules page just so you can see everything as one unit. Okay. Uh, so this is week one, and so we were just looking at the links for the laboratory. And then here's the assignments. So as you finish uh, your laboratory work, uh, you'll be uploading uh, your exercise one from your lab book. So you'll be filling in uh, the answers in your laboratory book. You'll be scanning it uh, and then uploading that document. Uh, same thing for exercise two. Uh, and so you guys will be turning those into me and I'll be grading them and giving you credit for it. Uh, the last couple things for week one uh, is laboratory work on mastering, and then homework for chapter one, uh, and then a quiz uh, for chapter one. Now, I did give you a couple weeks to work on the homework and quiz, uh, and you have until the following Friday to complete your laboratory work, uh, just in case it took you a little bit longer uh, to get your mastering uh, access. Uh, but in the future, you'll typically have one week to get your homework uh, and quiz uh, assignment done uh, as you're working on uh, your module for that week. And then unit one continues. So week two of the semester, uh, you'll be doing chemistry. And so here's all of your videos uh, and then your concept review, your laboratory work, and then of course your homework and your quiz assignment for that week. Week three of the unit, working on cells. And so all the various pages that you guys can watch videos and take notes uh, on cells, your concept review, your laboratory work, and of course, turning in your homework and quiz on time uh, in mastering. And then finally, we'll finish unit one, uh, the fourth week of the semester by going through tissues and the integumentary system. We will be doing a concept review for that again, your laboratory work, and then your homework and quiz. Once you finish all four weeks of the first unit, then there will be a unit one lecture exam. You will have a week to study for that, and then you'll take the unit one lecture exam uh, the fifth week of the semester. And then once we complete that unit, then we will move on to unit two. And so I'll open up unit two for you guys uh, and you'll be able to watch uh, the introduction to unit two uh, and get yourself uh, ready for uh, the next four to five weeks of the semester. All right, hope that helps. Thanks for watching. Bye.